God bless you, God bless you, God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, my name is Apostle Peter Daniel. You are watching me in heaven and hell live program, the one we used to do uh, every Monday to Friday by morning 9 a.m. to 10 30 a.m. every day. I pray the Lord God will bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, by the grace of God, I want to speak about the message God spoke to me on uh, on some things. But before we 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 go ahead, let's pray, please. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Internal rock of ages, the king of glory, the lord of Lord, the Eshadai, the Elohim, the Adonai. We bless your name, be that glorified and exalted in the mighty name of Jesus. Our Lord and our God, we ask you, Father, as they are looking at me, you will, you, will, you will reveal yourself to everyone looking at me. You will go deep into their life. You will visit them with your mighty hands you will release your fire upon their heart in the mighty name of jesus you will ask oh lord we ask you lord that you will reveal the mystery of your word to them thank you father in jesus mighty name we pray amen the lord bless you in the mighty name of jesus uh by the grace of god i uh, i was uh, heading to somewhere and uh, God spoke to me about a uh, mountain of fire, mountain of fire, MFA. One of the things is when God was speaking to me, he began to mention some things to me. He began to mention some things to me. He began to mention some things to me. And uh, I'm going to go a little bit deeper on what God told me. Uh, the Lord spoke to me about the activities that is going on in Mountain of Fire, whereby Dr. Olukoya established a football team. Dr. Olukoya established a football team, and God told me how angry it is that he has been he has been angry with him for that, that he's not happy with that. I want to tell you this, everyone that is hearing me. If you are mountain on fire members, or you are going there, or if there is any way you are a pastor there, I just want you to send this message, to send this uh, this message, and I, I I want you to to make sure that this message go viral, please, so that he can hear it himself. Probably he can change before he meets the Lord God Almighty. In heaven before he make the judgment in heaven I want to tell you that full boy is not part of gospel the house of God is church the house of God is the Bible says is a house of prayer not a house of football God told me how angry he is against MFM because of the football team moves have been established about 15 years ago. He established a football team, a football club in the house of God. Even though, if God can be angry, if Jesus Christ our Lord can be angry against those who are selling the things they can use for prayers in the front of the temple. How much more you that bring football into the house of God? Is house of God be a, a house of a football center or a sports center? I don't know why thoughts are like this. I am talking to Pastor Dr. Olukoya. Please, God can use somebody on head. That doesn't mean that the person is going to heaven. The matter of heaven is a is a is, is, is a serious thing. God will not change his standard because of you. If Jesus Christ can take a wife, 
to wipe out those people who are selling things in the front of the temple of God where they are using to pray God will also wipe you if you didn't repent the fact to remain the fact that God is a holy God and he wants his hours to be holy how will you bring football after I receive this message from God I have to search for you on net to ask to look whether I want to look at your motive you say because football is your favorite because you have been playing football when you are young so you want to use it as a means of converting people did God send you to use the means of the world to convert them you bring in football to the house of God you preaching is it not enough that you bring in football to the house of God I want to tell you this that God is not happy with you go and repent and you that you are happy with it and you are going to mountain of fire happy with what they are doing they are you too are heading to hell Yes, sir. The house of God is a house of preparing sin. It's not the house whereby you just play. No, 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 no. You don't do that. You bring sport into the house of God. And you are calling God. Let me tell you something. That you pray and you won in any competition you go to does not mean that God is with you. I used to say this to people many times. Praying to God for an answer does not qualify you that you are going to heaven. The Bible said, and whosoever his name is not written in the book of life is cast into the lake of fire. That book of life is God himself. It's a only book. A righteous book that no dot is in there, no dirty, no stain is there. You cannot be bringing football to the house of God and be reasoning that you are going to heaven. It's not possible. It's not even God that led you in your own ideas. Bringing football to the house of God in your own ideas. In your own idea, Dr. Olukoya. If you do repent from this, you are on your way to hell. Because you are totally doing what is against God. Certainly in the Bible where it is written. For a Christian to be to be playing football. Is it that the Holy Spirit has not spoken to you about it or what? Or you are rejecting the voice of God? Please, the house of God is a house of prayer, not a house of sport. Try to bring more members to your church. It's not what God is saying. These children of God, be careful so that you don't end up in hell. This is contradicting Bible. God is asking me to warn you again. I pray you will not go to hell in Jesus' name. You will not go to hell in Jesus' name. The Lord bless you and the Lord be with you. This is a short message I want to give you about mountain of fire. Please share it to every one of them. Share it to every one of God. This is the voice of God for you. And if you only fail to repent, this can lead you to hell. I pray you will not go to hell in Jesus' name. God bless you. God be with you. I remain Apostle Peter Daniel. Please kindly subscribe to this channel before you go. And press notification button. God bless you in Jesus name. Bye.